first thing that I'm doing is going into the app store and showing you guys the apps that you're going to need. So first thing you need is Fonto and then you're also going to need Magic Eraser. So yeah, I'm just downloading those too. So once I've downloaded those apps, I'm just going to head into Safari and search purple Instagram um png so i'm just getting the different um png social media images that i need so i'm going on to google images and just looking so once i stumbled across this one i just went to the actual website um and i can put it in the description but basically i just went to the website and then saved that um image to my phone when i put add to photos and then i just searched for the other um icons so i searched for snapchat as well as twitter and then just um save those images to my phone So once I have all the icons that I want, I'm just going to head into Fonto and I click on plain images and just click on a square, a white square image. And then I'm just going to add the PNG um, icons. So here I am just um, sizing them down and um, just positioning them so that they all line up vertically. I have done that I'm just going to add the text so I just put my social media handles so my Instagram and Twitter is your friend Asia and my snapchat is Asia boot underscore ma so I'm just doing that Helvetica new bold italic is the font that I'm using so I just go into style and I'm going to go to stroke and choose a purple um, color to match the actual icons and then I'm going to go over to style and then use like a block letter kind of thing. So once I've got that, I'm just going to position the text directly next to the icon. And then I'm just clicking on the copy button and then I'm just going to change the text um, as I see fit. I have everything the text the icons all of it um, I'm just going to save that image and then I'm going to head over to magic eraser so in the magic eraser app, I'm just gonna click um, on the target color I'm just targeting the white and it takes it and makes it into a PNG image and so I'm just saving that to my phone and then I'm going to head over to the photos and airdrop it to my Mac so here I'm watching Bojack Horseman, but y'all can see I'm just saving it to my download. Here it is. So I'm in iMovie right now and I'm just showing you guys how I put it on iMovie. So um, here I'm just clicking picture in picture and then 
um, clicking on fit so it shows the whole thing and then going back and changing the dissolve time to zero that way it just um, pops up and it doesn't dissolve and so I'm just you can expand it you can change it you can move it to different corners as you'd like I get so many DMs and so many comments asking me what do i recommend for editing on a phone guys i don't edit on my phone i edit on a computer so i don't know what apps to use i have no idea i've never edited on a phone so please don't ask me to google it um but here i'm just showing you how i get it to stay on my video all the way through so i just um take the end and i just drag it all the way into the end of my video and i stop it right um before my end screen pops up